Hi Sagittarius, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Sag with a clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see what's happening for you this week, Sagittarius. All right, we've got the Ten of Wands. We've got the Queen of Cups. We've got the Queen of Swords. Okay. And we have the Four of Pentacles. All right, so somebody feels like, where is this going? We got two queens here. It could be same sex relationship. Okay. If it is not same sex relationship, then we've got two people showing up in the same energy doers trying to maintain, maybe maintain the relationship. We've got also one person looking away from the connection and we've got one who is emotionally withdrawn, you know, maybe even a little self-centered comes off a little aloof, concerned about only themselves. You both are doing something, but it's apart from one another, or it's you guys are just not on the same wavelength. You or the other person feels like this is a burden. You know, this relationship, this connection has become burdensome. It has become, it's a lot going on. Maybe even in terms of money, the two of pentacles coming out. The ten of wands says that, uh, somebody's kind of on autopilot, just, you know, showing up either for work, for the relationship, whatever, just showing up, not knowing where it's going. Someone is carrying the burden of the connection. Could be you, Sagittarius. Um, the four of pentacles, you feel like somebody is dependent upon you, uh, interdependent upon each other, or there's an energy of clinginess or someone's clinging to you, maybe because you're their stability, their rock here. Somebody is definitely in their feminine energy, even if you are a man. The three of cups coming out also socialize, get in the group or get with a group or network or, or something of that nature. Bring something back from the past, the judgment card coming out. It's like somebody need, knows that they need to make a decision here, maybe to cut something off or cut something out or something has been uh, very um stressful somebody is kind of like cracking under the weight of their own success here they have a lot going on with the ten of wands here it could be travel the two of pentacles says doing two different things to earn income it may be stressful for some looking in from the outside but it, it seems as if you have a handle on it rhythm getting into the rhythm of it juggling many things going on Maybe even with your social connections, social events. This could be waiting for a judgment, waiting for something to go in your favor. This could even be um, court. It's a lot in the past that's happening with the moon card. the knight of cups so you do something creative for work and it's like i don't know you you create you put something out you gotta think outside of the box to get around something something has been a burden something has been holding you up The Six of Swords, something about maybe even travel or letting something go or something not being expressed. You could want to travel, Seven of Pentacles, but you're waiting for something to manifest or you feel restricted. Some of you could even want to be single, but there's restriction. I don't know, it's like an inter codependent type of relationship. Let's see what's going on here for Sagittarius. It's like no movement. 
it's like you and your person are both trying to create your own thing. It causes for clump. It causes conflict sometimes. It's like interdependence, but yeah, opposition came out balance. Um, interacts, confronts, makes conscious, manifests discipline, tests objectives, calls out conflicts with. So opposition. So something is, yeah, you guys are in direct opposition for one another. It's like you're not co-creating. It's like you are just um, creating on your own, doing your own thing. Uh, maybe it's working for you. What else do we have for Sag? It just seems like two different entities. Yeah, cancer could be dealing with the cancer. Um, sympathetic, co confronting, nostalgic. So you could be thinking about something from the past Maybe this is you, the Queen of Cups, or this is your person. Someone wants to go back. They want to bring something back. They want to relive or revive something. Someone's thinking about going back to a past person. Somebody feels restricted because Six of Swords, because they haven't sp spoken exactly how they feel. Somebody wants to come back to you and maybe even make an offer to you. It could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. They're not sure if you'll take to their offer. They're in between. They're weighing it up, weighing the pros and the cons. And somebody knows that they um, neglected, didn't accept, maybe even took you for granted or took the relationship for granted. Somebody is a taker. Somebody is a gold digger. Somebody is out for status here. Okay. It's like you haven't... Somebody needs to forgive the other person. And that's why you guys are in direct opposition. Someone can't forget what the other person did. So it's like, I can't get over this. Therefore, that is the stumbling block. Therefore, we're both coming up as queens because I'm doing my own thing and you're doing your own thing. And we're just not. Um, yeah. Somebody needs to take action. Mars at the bottom of the deck. Desire, impulse, courage, force, strength. Sex drive, energy, leadership, anger. Yes, it's like competition. It's like somebody is angry. You know, they're still angry about whatever transpired between you two. So this is what I have for you, Sag. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Um, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, click that subscribe and the bell button so you know when I'm going live because you can ask questions on the lives. Um, thank you. Take care. Many blessings to you.